If you have just ended your relationship or you want to get insights about how to overcome the emotional setbacks due to your breakup, then you have just come to the right place. I know it is hard to get over your ex instantly, but trust me it is the best thing you can ever do with yourself. This is the most difficult period of your life especially if you have split your ways into bad terms. I know what you are feeling right now. The pain of breaking up literally is like someone ripped your heart and stomped at it again and again. But what's more powerful is how fast you can recover from your sadness and move on with your life. The reality is that the longer your relationship was, the greater the pain you will feel. So naturally, it will take some time to heal your wound. Now you are in the condition that you cannot stop yourself thinking about them. You might start possesses about the thought what will your ex doing, whom he, she is dating or seeing right now. The very first thing to overcome your desire is to realize that there is no hope now. You have to keep in mind that you cannot start the process of healing your soul until you have accepted this truth. All the doors which were going to that particular person are closed now. There is no way you can get back together. And if you are the one who is now in an immerse pain then let's consider that you are probably not the one who has broken down things off. Here are some tips which can be beneficial if you are really willing to get over your ex. 1. Stop blaming yourself if you are the one who got dumped. I have news for you. There's nothing wrong with you. Sometimes bad things happen that don't mean your entire life going in the wrong direction. It doesn't matter who loves you. You should love yourself first. You should value your mental and emotional health first. If you go too hard on yourself it will affect your other areas of work also. It will reflect on your career, social life, and family. Don't make others suffer because of some bad chapters in your life. 2. Clear out the things which remind you of them. These things can be included as messages. Cards, letters, etc. Clear out all those things which will pour salt on your wound. These are the things by seeing them you cannot get over your emotions. By seeing them you will feel sad then emotional and finally you will be angry over yourself and people around you. Those things are the memory maps to the other person and it will lead to recall the memories when you both were together. You will blame yourself and it could be the start of your psychological imbalance in your life. So, get rid of the things that remind you of them as soon as possible. 3. Avoid the places you might meet them. This method is only preferred if you cannot take the presence of your ex. There may be some common places where you two could meet. Then you have to avoid those places. This may sound irrelevant but is an important step because if you are still in the process of healing and getting over it, seeing them in front of you will shake and blow you up and there are more chances that you will be knocked out by your emotions. 4. Give yourself break. There's no shame in seeking help. It's okay to get frustrated or whatever emotion you are feeling right now. There are no specific laws on how you should spend your life. Remember it's your life. You should first focus on yourself. Allow yourself to feel all the emotions so that you can easily move on. Time is the best medicine to healing. So give yourself some time. You can use the time to gain insight, healthier relationships, and an orientation toward growth. Also, time can be used as an opportunity to collect experiences that orient them toward their values and dilute or challenge difficult experiences. You just have to admit the reality that you cannot go back to the way you were before and there's no use in crying over spilled milk. Your ex is not there but you are. You have your own personality and identity. Just because someone betrayed you doesn't mean your life has been ended. There are billions of people in the world, and you just need one to move on. Change your mindset then everything around you will change. 5. Think of the future possibilities. Now you have no chains of relationship or responsibilities on your feet. There are amazing chances waiting ahead for you. If you are a student concentrate on your studies, take your classes, spend a lot of time with friends. You can work on your career, give time to your job or business, earn a lot of money. Focus on your plans which you couldn't fulfill because of your ex-relationship. Explore the world and enjoy the advantages of being single. Make yourself a positive person. If you had any kind of self-doubt or insecurities work on fixing those issues. Once you start doing it there will be people who see good in you and start attracting towards you. Be happy. The universe is going to start a new chapter in your life and this could be even better compared to the last one.